Good morning vlog. Well, it's like 5 a.m. It's the first hour of my day, and uh, I'm gonna go to breakfast. Banana. 6 a.m. Second hour. Driving to the airport. This is cool. I haven't been on the new bridge yet. It's pretty. Nice. I wonder why they pay to light this part of the bridge. Ooh, it's, a Ooh, it is a pretty chilly morning here in Edinburgh and I'm just heading into the airport. Mm, vanilla cooler. Ah, it's the first morning in Edinburgh. It's sunrise We're on the tarmac. Ooh. with emeralds and leprechauns and all that crap. <laughs> was that a good or bad accent? I think that was a terrible accent. <laughs> anyway, I did make it to Ireland and I am now uh, heading for my connecting flight to Chicago. Uh, so yeah, got it just a couple of hours-ish to wait on that to get some food and yeah, do that. Fifth hour and I'm going to pre-clear US immigration. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Flight 123 to Chicago will board shortly here at 8 Six. We'd ask you to please remain seated until called. When we commence boarding, we'll start with priority on business class, followed by families with children under five years of age, and we will then board the main cabin by seat row numbers. Okay, two things. First thing, I just went and bought food, and I tried to pay with Apple Pay, and I'm in Ireland, obviously I'm not in the UK, and it just didn't work, and I have service, I have data. I don't know, it doesn't even need it. I've done it like with no service on the London Underground before. And I I don't know why why it not working. Maybe someone can tell me that. Second thing, I uh, I had my seat allocation somehow ended up as like a middle seat. Um, and I had, to, when I came through, uh, I asked at the transfer desk if they could look and see if my seat was an aisle seat because I wanted an aisle seat. And it wasn't, they said the flight was full, but come to the gate when you come through. And at Dublin here, which is really cool, you pre-clear US immigration, as you saw. And I got through, it's all good. Um, and it means I don't have to worry about that when I get to Chicago. And when a flight gets to Chicago, it's essentially treated as a domestic flight. So I basically just walk off the flight and walk out the airport, which is great. I did get my seat moved though. And I feel a little bit bad because the seat that became available was someone who did not clear US immigration and apparently had a visa issue. So I took their seat. Um, not my fault, obviously, but I just, I just can't help feeling a little bit like weird about that, and that someone else is actually going to be on that flight, and they're, they, because of a visa issue or whatever, they did not clear, and they couldn't board the flight, so um, they couldn't come through. So, yeah, that, that's kind of, it's kind of funny, but. Um, Thanks for your patience, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so I have to go and board my flight soon, and also eat this food. Uh, it's about 11 o'clock now, and that means we're into the seventh hour of this journey. Um, I am surprisingly not tired, given I only had like four hours sleep. That's a much bigger aircraft than this morning. about the 11th hour right now and I'm pretty tired 
just finished watching one of the Harry Potter films. It's pretty good. And uh, now I am going to watch another one. The aim of this day is to not sleep and for this day to last 24 hours. So we'll see. Uh, we're about halfway through this experience. Bear in mind I'm running on about 4 hours sleep. I'm in my 16th hour of travelling and being awake and yep, I'm still kind of tired but I've now made it to the terminal and I'm just going to go get my bags. So after getting, after getting lost in quite a few times in this terminal trying to find the baggage collection, finally I got my bag, turns out uh, Jamie who's picking me up is going to be delayed by a while, a few hours I think, a couple of hours maybe, yeah. Uh, so I, taxis are apparently really expensive, so I'm, gonna, I'm hopping over to Terminal 2 to get a train into the city and then get a train out to um, where Jamie stays, so that seems easier. Uh, if not, I'll just wait Terminal 2 for Jamie. <laughs> Sitting here at Starbucks with the bottle of water, hour 7, 17th hour? 17th hour, I can do this. Pretty tired, but I can do this. Just gonna lie on this table for a bit. <laughs> okay, just standing out here waiting on Jamie. I think she's should be not too far away. So I also sat down. I was standing in a Starbucks in there, and I sat next to a lovely woman, and I was chatting about a bunch of stuff. It's great how you can just like meet people in these places and just strike up a conversation. It's the 18th hour, and I found um, Jamie. Hello. Mmm, giant pizza. Noodles? Question mark. All gone. Oh. <laughs> we got food before we head back to you know wherever we're going. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 19th there, and we're stuck in traffic. How do you feel about the traffic? Cars. What? No, I'm feeling good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We just went past the car crash. Oh wow. Oh damn. Park it is now. So it's later in the day and it's now the 23rd hour of me being like dazed and awake. Uh, Jim just got a haircut. Woo. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna pick up uh, a thing and then hopefully swing by Jake's um, because it's his birthday and a card for him. So yeah, I'm really tired. <laughs> it's long and tiring. <laughs> you tired, Jamie? Hey, Jake. Yes. Long drive. Hey Jake, how are you? I'm alright, how are you? I'm good. When was the last time you were in the vlog? Last, I don't know, when you were here, uh, in July. Oh yeah. It wasn't even that long ago. You're right. Alright then. <laughs> well, uh, I made it to 24 hours. Um, unfortunately I wasn't feeling particularly well at that point. My stomach was just really uneasy and unsettled. So I didn't really feel like vlogging. Um, but... I did make it. Uh, thank you for watching the vlog. And if you liked it, hit the like button below. If you didn't like it, hit the like button anyway. And I'd also appreciate it if you would subscribe to the YouTube channel, follow me on the Facebook page, and of course on vid.me. And if you would like to share the video with your friends and family, I would also appreciate that. Anyway, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Adios.